he is coming tomorrow uh, to win the game, uh, which is which is normal, which is uh, human because uh, he did it m many times in his career. Uh, but thanks God, I have experience on both of a coaching the the favorite team on the paper uh, and underdog too. And uh, I can tell you that we're going to be ready, like we played, uh, like we playing any any Euroleague team. I respect them a lot. The way how they're playing, the way how they uh, coach it. And uh, one more time, we're going to be ready. I think there. Uh, I mean, there's always pressure when you're competing for a championship. Uh, eight cups in a row is a very impressive feat, and we want to continue it. But uh, at the same time, I don't think uh, you want to put the extra pressure on yourself. You know, our focus is on today's practice and to come to tomorrow uh, as prepared and as ready as we can be. There's so many things uh, to do uh, <clears throat> defensively, offensively. But when you already brought it, uh, one of the details, uh, which is very important, and I think uh, I don't, I, I don't think that I can say that it's a key, because there is the couple of more things we have to complete. Um, yeah, I mean, like you said, it's a, it's a great opportunity. It would be a you know a great honor and accomplishment to be able to win a trophy. Uh, but like we said, we're going to take it a step at a time. Uh, our focus now is on, on the game tomorrow and to do everything we can to get through it uh, to the championship. We can't uh, look too far ahead. I want to wish all the teams, four teams that came to the end of the game, and to the crowd that will come to the match. The Arabs are the winners, the winners are the winners, and the winners will win. Thank you to all.